Well, over the years, the definitions of, of commons has changed radically, so it, this, is, this is a difficult question to ask me because um, I am fully aware that if you're asking an economist to define the commons, it's a totally different question than if, you're, if you ask a, a legal scholar to define the commons. Um, so, I have been chewing on the idea of this, this idea that there's no commons without commoning. Um, I, uh, Lynn Ostrom and I have defined commons as a shared resource subject to um, vulnerability or social dilemmas. Now, if you say that there's no um, resource without commoning, it kind of, that kind of implies that. I'm caught up with the problem is that I do believe that in the global commons arena, there are in fact commons without where there's no commoning happening. There needs to be commoning happening. There needs to be people involved, but as, as yet, I think they're out there waiting for their community to come to them. Ha, ha, ha.